Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to show you how to replace the front brakes on a Mercedes W203. It's the same for all of them. This is from 2001 to 2007. So we got the genuine parts right here. Full brake pads, two on each side with the sensor. You need to make sure that you get the sensors. And this is the part number right here. If you need it, it comes with with the with the gray a brake paste with the gray paste. And stay with us to see how we did that and don't forget to subscribe, we upload about 5 new videos every week. Ok, we're going to show you how to do the right side, it's identical to the left side. So what you need to do now, jack the, the front end of the car, put the, jack, put the jack stand of course, safety first. And you need to take the wheel off. Ok, now if your wheel is stuck, you need to clean this one really good with sandpaper and it will slide right back on. So now in order to work on it, we need to turn the steering wheel to the right. Ok, now you need to get a big screwdriver and stick it between the brake pad and the disc and just pry until we compress the piston inside the caliper because the new parts are way bigger than the old ones and they will not just fit so we need to compress the piston all the way in. Ok, we already did that. Now right here we have two bolts. This one here and this one on the bottom. We need to remove the bolts with a 12 mm socket. All the way. Ok. And now this is the sensor right here. That's for the brake wire. So you need to pull it out of there. It it just clips like that and now you pull the whole caliper out of there ok and now that's the brake pads right here so they just slide to the outside ok this one and as you can see that's where the sensor is that's why you need to replace the sensor because they are no good once they are activated and now we need to replace the those glides the metal the metal ones because our kit came with brand new ones ok right there so you just get them and push them in you can hear the clipping there one on top one on bottom ok now right here on the back we are gonna apply that uh, brake paste right here on the back of the caliper so it doesn't squeal and make funny noises some there and now we need to get ok this is the outside part that's without the sensor and this one you just slide it right there push it in the grooves ok you need to make sure that it goes there in the grooves like that and you just push it in. Now the inside one is the one with the sensor. So you need to push the sensor in. Ok, let me... Ok, like that. And now you just need to push it from the back again in the, in the rails there. Like that. Okay, now you have to be careful with the sensor, it needs to go through the hole right here, pull it out of there so it's not in the way and you need to put the caliper on top of the brake pads. You need to line it, make sure it fits and now you need the bolts with the 12mm socket, install the bolts and tighten them all the way. Ok, you need to make sure that they are tight, don't forget to tighten them, that's very important. And the next step is we need to plug, plug the wire for the sensor. So right there, that's where the wire goes, it has an arrow, you can see right there, and you just push it in. And now you need to go inside the vehicle and hit the brake pedal a couple times, maybe 4 or 5 times, make sure that it compresses the piston and it gets all that play that you might have because otherwise you might not have brakes the first one or two times when you hit the, the brake pedal. 
Before we start the car, hit the brake pedal four or five times. And we just install the tire, and that's the whole procedure for replacing the parts. Thank you guys for watching us. Please give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos. We upload about five new videos every week.